a speedy consideration and passage of Mr. President's request for the 2023 supplementary budget. The day after it hosted ministers, INEC leadership and service chiefs, the House Committee on Appropriations presents its report, and the report was promptly considered at the Committee of Supply. Rise to move that the House do consider the report of the Committee on Appropriations on Bill of Foreign Acts to authorize the issue from the Consolidated Revenue Funds of the Federation to the total sum of two trillion. One hundred and seventy six billion seven hundred and ninety one million two hundred and eighty six thousand thirty three naira only. Um, State House is twenty eight uh, billion. Office of the National Security Advisor ten billion three hundred and sixty four million seven hundred and five thousand three hundred and fifty three naira. Addressing parliamentary reporters at the end of the exercise, Chairman of the Appropriations Committee of Bakar Bichi gives an insight into what was approved. He says 5 billion naira allocated for the purchase of a presidential yacht has now been added to the 5 billion naira earmarked for students' loans. We have approved that 35,000 increment. So far, we have approved about 210 billion naira for Nigerian workers, and I'm sure they are going to see that um, impact as soon as possible. Um, we have increased the student loan. If you can recall, student loan was um, 5 billion naira in the budget, but now we have increased it from 5 to 10 billion so that our students can be able to access that facility in order um, for them to go to school and to be affordable for them. The committee promises proper legislative oversight to ensure full implementation of the approved supplementary budget. Joker Edsa, TVC News, Abuja.